Imagine having this in your backyard, a huge rotting electric pole leaning against another. A mom in Cheektowaga says this has been her reality for years. So she sent us this video on Facebook. And tonight, 7 Eyewitness News reporter Brittany Muller tells us Nice Egg is taking action. Run, 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 run. My biggest concern is when my son's playing in the backyard, if like it were to fall like when he's back here. Michelle Bain has been living in her Cheektowaga home off Union Road with her two sons for six years. It's not intact at all on the bottom and like there's just pieces falling out of it and like there's a hole in the top and it's just getting worse every year. Bain is talking about this, two electric poles rotting on her property. They're here and it puts me and my neighbors and our kids at risk. Bain says she called NYSIG about the problem for the first time five years ago. I kept calling them and calling them and I really thought last year when I called them that they were going to remove the poles because they put two X's on my poles and I was like, yes, it's finally going to be done. NYSIG visited Bain's Cheek to Wagga home again Thursday morning, took pictures of the rotten poles to assess the damage. I feel like it would have been done already. Like, I don't understand why it's taking so long. A spokesperson for NYSEG says the aging poles are scheduled to be replaced by the end of June. NYSEG also says the poles are not a threat or danger to the community. There's no way that this is safe. Like, it can't be safe. And for Bain, safety for her and her kids is the top priority. It's all about them. They're number one and and needs to get taken care of for them. In Cheektowaga, Brittany Muller, 7 Eyewitness News.